Chris in the comment section of my last video asked if I could do just a quick test to show what the resistance was like on my switch wheel on my Brompton. So that's what this video is about. But I'm also going to take the opportunity to just compare it with the switch kit on this 26 inch mountain bike that I've just finished building. So let's give it a try first. This is the switch wheel, no battery, the battery's in my hand. So it's not powered on. So the wheel stops there pretty quickly. I don't think there's any point in putting a timer on that. I think you can all see how quickly that's stopping. So the bike's done about 100 kilometers now on this switch kit. Um, so it should be um, run in, so to speak. I try it with the battery on now, see if that makes any difference. Okay, so the battery's on and the bike's powered on. Okay, seen enough. We'll now try the 26 inch wheel mountain bike, see if that's any different. So the 26 inch wheel mountain bike is in the stand now. I've just finished installing this kit, so it hasn't done any miles at all this, yet, this one. So let's try the first test. Okay, so that's significantly different to the Brompton wheel. And we'll try the same test now with a battery in. So I'm going to put the battery in the bike and switch it on, see if that makes any difference. Okay, battery in, powered on. Okay, and there concludes our resistance tests of switch bike wheels. Hope that was useful.